Dear viewers, welcome to our channel. Today we are going to talk about approach to zombies. In this video, you can see the yellow coloration of the upper sclera of this patient. So, come to what is jaundice? Jaundice is an abnormal yellow discoloration of the skin, sclera, and mucous membranes, and it is usually detectable when serum bilirubin concentration rises above 50 micromole per liter, that is 3 mg per deciliter, as a result of parenchymal liver disease biliary obstruction or hemolysis so what are the history you should take in case of a jaundiced patient first of all associated symptoms such as abdominal pain fever weight loss itching etc then color of the stools should be searched for it is normal or pale then color of the urine normal or dark any history of alcohol intake, traveling to any endemic state or endemic place and also you should ask for immunization history of the patient. And it is important to ask about the intravenous drug use or recently prescribed drugs, previous blood transfusion and also you should take sexual exposure history. On physical examination, you should search for anemia, splenomegaly, hepatomegaly, and if there is hepatomegaly, it is tender or non-tender, you should search for that. You should also search for stigmata of chronic liver disease, such as in hand, a palmar erythema, dupitans contracture, clubbing. In upper chest, you should search for spider and geoma, gynecomasia and also in the face you should search any genthalasma, spider and geoma, etc. You should search for the scratch mark may be present in obstructive jaundice, also mass in the epicastrium, palpate the gallbladder, see the Murphy sign, also check the bony tenderness and search for any kind of bleeding manifestations. Also, you should search for ascites in the abdomen, check the neck for the limb node and examine the leg for beating edema present or not, which may be present in congestive cardiac failure with, uh, where tender hepatomegal with jaundice may occur. So, what are the investigations you will suggest? First of all, liver function test such as serum bilirubin. HGPT, HGOT, alkaline phosphatase, prothrombin time. Ultrasonogram of hepatobiliary system is an important investigation in this case. You should do viral markers, especially the hepatotropic virus. And for this, for A, that is for hepatitis A virus, you should do anti HAV immunoglobulin M. For E virus, you should do anti HEV immunoglobulin M, do hepatitis B surface antigen, hepatitis E antigen, anti HBC antigen, or in some times the viral lo DNA load. For hepatitis C virus, we can do anti ACV. Other investigations should be done according to the suspicion of the cause. Such for hemolytic anemia, you should do hemoglobin electrophoresis. In obstructive jaundice, ERCP or MRCP may be done. CT scan of whole abdomen can be done. So, what is about the treatment? In case of treatment, we can divide in, in two categories general measures and specific treatment. General measures include bed rest, maintenance of nutrition, prevention of complication and in specific measures according to cause so thanks for watching if you like this video please subscribe the channel thank you